Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rizat Graphics. In this short After Effects tutorial, I am going to show you a fast and easy way to morph shapes in Adobe After Effects. Let's have a look. So, let's get started. First of all open Adobe After Effects, and create a new composition. Rename it to Morph Shapes or whatever name you like. Set the resolution to 1920 by 1080 pixels, 30 frames per second and set the duration to 10 seconds. Go to the toolbar, and select the rectangle tool. Hold the shift plus alt on keyboard and draw a square. Center the anchor point, then align the square shape to the center. Rename the shape to square. Then under the rectangle 1, right click on rectangle path 1, and convert to bezier path, under the path 1. Add a keyframe. That's it. Now, we have to make two or three more shapes. Go to the toolbar, and select the ellipse tool. Then change the fill color. And draw a circle by holding the shift plus alt key on the keyboard. Center the anchor point, then align it to the center. Rename it to the circle. Under the ellipse 1, then under the ellipse path 1, convert to bezier path. Then under path 1, and add a keyframe. Drag the circle just below to the square shape. Go to the toolbar and select the polygon tool and create a shape by holding the shift and alt key on the keyboard. Center the anchor point, and align the shape to the center. Rename the shape to the polygon, then under the polystar 1, right click on polystar 1, and convert to a bezier path, under the path 1, add a keyframe. Go to the toolbar, and select the star tool. Change the fill color to any color you like. Then create a star by holding the shift and alt key on the keyboard. Now, center the anchor point. Then align the star to the center. Rename the shape layer to star. Then under the polystar 1, right click on polystar path 1 and convert to a bezier path. Under the path 1, add a keyframe. Now, select all layers, and press U on the keyboard to reveal all keyframes. Select the square path keyframe, and press Ctrl plus C to copy it. Go to 1 second on the timeline, and then paste it. Now, copy the circle path keyframe. Go to about 2 seconds on a timeline. Select the square path. And paste it. Select the move tool. Then drag the circle here. Now, copy the keyframe. Go to about 3 seconds, and paste it. Select the circle shape, and delete it. We don't need it. Now, copy the polygon shape path keyframe. Go to about 4 seconds on the timeline. Select the square path, and paste the keyframe. Drag the polygon to the center. Copy the same keyframe. Then go to about 5 seconds, and paste it. Select the polygon shape layer and delete it. Copy the star shape path keyframe, 
Go to about 6 seconds on the timeline. Select the square path. And paste it. Drag the star to the center. Copy the same keyframe again. And go to about 7 seconds and paste it. Finally copy the first keyframe of square path. And go to about 8 seconds on the timeline. And paste it. Delete the star shape layer. Let's see what we've created. Cool. It looks amazing. Let me show you how you can change the shape colors. Under the rectangle one, then go to the fill. Add a keyframe on color property. Then change the color. Go to about one second and add a keyframe with the same color. Go to about two seconds and change the color. Let me do it faster to save your time. Let's preview it. Perfect. Select the square shape layer, and press U to reveal all keyframes. Let's fix the keyframe timing. Now, select all keyframes. Right click, go to keyframe assistant, and select easy ease. Let's preview it again. Perfect. It looks amazing to me, and I am happy with the results. I hope you've learned a lot from this tutorial. Please hit the like button if you find this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more tutorials. I'll see you next time on Rizat Graphics. Thanks for watching. Good luck.